Hi everybody, I'm Joe Stowe, and today I've got a unique piece of gear from the 1980s, you just don't see these anymore, and that is an MXR digital time delay uh, rack mount unit. Now I'm going to be demoing this today uh, using my trusty Partscaster Esquire guitar, so it just has one pickup in the bridge position, so it's a very jangly, trebly sounding guitar. Just uh, playing some chords. Uh, this MXR unit really sounds amazing. Um, it's a lot more subtle than a modern uh, delay pedal or chorus pedal or flanger pedal, you know, where the knobs are really uh, reactive. This, it's a lot more subtle sounding unit. This is my favorite sound that I've, I've come across on this so far. Now you can really kind of dial things in, but this is a real nice chorusy sound. I'm really falling in love with it uh, just for this sound by itself. <laughs> Just love that. Just real subtle modulation. A little less than you would hear on a modern chorus pedal. Let me uh, show you what it, just my guitar sounds by itself. I have some reverb on. And then I put the pedal, uh, the uh, MXR unit in. Okay, so here is the MXR digital time delay. And you can see it has different sections. Now this is about from the 1980s. It'll do flanging, it'll do delay, it'll do chorusing. Um, they have a section on here marked doubling. You can invert the delay. Uh, you can, just like in modern pedal, you know, you can uh, adjust your regeneration, how much uh, wet and dry, and uh, you can adjust the speed of the delays, uh, the width of the uh, processing, and the delay time. Now you have three buttons over here that you can use for your delay time. Now you can have all three out, you can have all three in, you can just have one at a time or two at a time. Now right now for my favorite chorus setting, um, I have two the two buttons pushed in here, the 5 and the 80, and and you can see what my settings are. They're pretty much right around 12 o'clock, well actually 1 o'clock for my uh, settings, the mix right down the middle, and regeneration I just have uh, at uh, the second dot up. And it uh, just sounds really nice. <laughs> You can't save anything on here, so if you need to save something, well, you're going to have to write it down in a notebook and uh, save your settings that way with a pencil and paper. <laughs> Regeneration will uh, be how many repeats we get. I can slow down my speed on that. See here. Now, if we add in, there we go. I could get lost with that one all day. <laughs> okay, so now that was our delay, long delay time. Now let's tr see what we can get for flanging. Let's try this. Yeah, get a little bit 
there. sounds pretty neat. So what I did was I pushed in the first two buttons. So you can get different sounds. You know, I showed you what the chorus sound is like, uh, the doubling. We pretty much, now what you can do is you can make it sound like a robot if you wanted to do that. Um, let's see. You know, you can kind of make it make it sound like all kinds of crazy sounds if you wanted to. So, unfortunately, you can't save the settings. But, you know, if you write them down, you'll remember them. This is kind of an item that you might just have one or two sounds that you really can get out, you know, that you like, that you're going to use all the time. So for me, I would use this setting here. I would probably do this chorus setting. Oh yeah, here we go. So here's the thing, so I don't remember exactly where I was. I know I think I was around one o'clock. In a nutshell, that is your MXR digital time delay. Everybody, take it easy.